Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this video, we are going to solve one quartic equation with the help of substitution. Equation is x minus 1, x minus 2, 3x minus 2, 3x plus 1 equal to 32. I will use algebraic method. That means substitution. Then ultimately we will get quadratic formula real solution. So we will see all together. So let's get started. Let me consider this bracket is A. This bracket is B, this bracket is C, this bracket is D. I am going to write AC times BD equal to 32. So let us write x minus 1, 3x minus 2, x minus 2, 3x plus 1 equal to 32. Now multiply the first two bracket 3x square x times minus 2 minus 2x minus 1 times 3x minus 3x so minus 5x minus 1 times minus 2 plus 2. Same way the last two brackets x times 3x 3x square x times 1 so x minus 2 times 3x minus 6x x minus 6x minus 5x minus 2 into 1 so minus 2 equal to 32. Now you can easily see this term I am going to substitute something. Why? Then it will become easier. So let us consider 3x square minus 5x let 3x square minus 5x is equal to t. So, equation will convert into t plus 2, t minus 2 equal to 32. Now, difference of square formula that is a plus b times a minus b is a square minus b square. So, it will become t square minus b square. So, let me write 2 square equal to 32, t square minus 4 is equal to 32. Add 4 to both sides. t square is equal to 36. So t, take square root both sides, equal to plus minus 6. Now, how you will know then that which bracket you have to take so that your product will come out same. This way substitution possibility is there. Important point is this. So there were two options. If you will take product directly, means right now A, B, C, D in this form, then first two bracket will give you leading coefficient 1, x square you will get. The last two terms, last two brackets you will get 9x square. So it won't match. So obviously it was confirmed that either you will take A, C, B, D or you will take A, D, A, D and B, C. These are the two possibilities. If you will take AD, then also your leading coefficient will come out 3. Okay, now you have to take, means out of two options, you will pick only one. One more clue is there. If you are taking AC, then these two constant product will be 2 without sign. And C, BD against 2. So that will make the correct option which you have to consider. Okay, let's solve. Let's put back t equal to 3x square minus 5x. t is equal to 6, t is equal to minus 6. 3x square minus 5x equal to 6. 3x square minus 5x is equal to minus 6. Take all the terms to left side. Three x square minus 5x minus 6 is equal to 0. 3x square minus 5x plus 6 is equal to 0. Now quadratic formula. So let us apply quadratic formula. 
a is equal to 3, b is equal to negative 5, c is equal to negative 6. a is equal to 3. I am solving parallelly both the equations so that you can see the difference. c is equal to 6. Now let's find x minus b, so 5 plus minus square root b square, so minus 5 is square minus 4ac, 4 times 3 times negative 6 over 2a, so 6. In this case, x is equal to minus b, so 5 plus minus square root b square so minus 5 is square again minus 4 times 3 times 6 over 2a so 6 x will be equal to 5 plus minus square root 25 now you can see uh, it will come out plus and 72 divided by 6. Here you will be getting 5 plus minus 25 and 6 times 4 into 372 again. That value is same, only the sign difference is there. 5 plus minus, this will be uh, 97, the square root 97 over 6. Now second solution is 5 plus minus this value is 47 with negative sign. So let us write negative 47 over 6. Now we know that we can write this minus, let me show here, minus 47 you can write, it is 47 iota square because negative sign is there so iota will come outside it will be negative i square root 47 so let me write that value 5 plus minus iota root 47 over 6 now you can see the difference uh, the real solutions we need to find out x is 5 plus root 97 over 6. This is our answer for this question. And x is equal to 5 minus root 97 over 6. If you will see the remaining means this solution is complex solution. So this solution is complex solution. So our real solution is x is equal to 5 plus root 97 over 6 and 5 minus root 97 over 6. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe and give like impression for my video. Thank you so much.